Hello, everybody. My name's the Silver Requiem. <laughs> Oh, I mean, um, <clears throat> Robo Milf Hunter 69420 YOLO Dabber. And welcome back to uh, Atomic Heart. Ah, Mother Russia. It is so good to be back. The smell of potatoes, the sweet, the sweet, sweet sniff of vodka. Oh, and democracy. Or is it communists? All oh, the communisms. Oh. I don't know about politics, but mmm. Tasty, tasty stuff. There has been a little bit of a little. This is the last time I played this game. Oh, not that long, actually. I've been playing Dark Souls again. What I can say, it's so good. So, if you missed the last episode, we. By this weird sequence of us tripping balls, find everyone's dead, and then our father, like our father, like figure saying, "Oh, you're the only one that survived, so you need to find Petrov again because he's alive." I'm like, "Hmm, that's a bit sounds a bit dodgy, mate." So I'm thinking that he's he's using us, and and when we find Petrov, we're gonna be like, "Oh shit, we've been on the wrong side this whole time." So, speaking of Petrov, we need to find him again, because we found him, then we got passed out, and then Petrov and his girlfriend found out that... But yeah, yeah, um, uh, sorry, um... Petrov's girlfriend found out that Petrov's been using all the robots to kill everybody, even though she's a doctor and she doesn't want anyone to die. But it's like, oh, it's for the greater good, and she walked out, and so he walked out, and then sometime, like, probably later, we escaped and we have to find him again. So that's basically what happened. Also, I did some mixing up stuff. It at right at the end of the other episode. So I don't have to act anymore. I got the snowball. There's a lot more damage. The enemy has raised its alert level to maximum major. But it's, it gets a bit slower. Okay. I may have been seen. Oi! No. So let's get that all and get a car. Wait, well, that's quick. Reach the theater. Just fine. I'm gonna see you real soon too. So get ready, prick. Trust me, the preparations are well underway. There will be surprises, dog. You turn the Lisa against me, bitch. She doesn't return my calls. Yeah, you're breaking my heart. I don't give two wet farts about your relationship. Charles, can you trace the call? Where is that shit stain? The signal's coming from the Plisetskaya Theater. A theater? Right here in the facility? <laughs> what a clown. It's a theater, comrade major, not a circus. Barking the way Whatever. I won't let that traitor get away from me again. Oh, call. There we go, they're finally in the theater now. Uh, we're gonna get in. I'm GTA this. I live by literally using everyone. Oh god. You know what? Easy to get around. Okay. God. Let's keep going. Oh! Dead! I exploded. Fair enough. I mean, the game's the game, but still. Okay. I thought I had some time to get out. Alright. Find a different car then. <laughs> I'm back here. Alright. Let's get out of this caboodle. Delphine. Delphi. Already free, Major? Oh, what? Did you not expect to hear from me? Not only can I hear you just fine, I'm gonna see you real soon, too. It, so get ready, it, prick. Ooh, Trust miss me, you. the preparations are well underway. There will be surprises, dog. Mm -hmm. You turned the Lisa against me, bitch. She doesn't return my calls. Yeah, you're breaking my heart. I don't give two wet farts about your relationship. Charles, can you trace the call? Where is that shit stain? The signal's coming from the Plisetskaya Theater. A theater? Right here in the facility? <laughs> what a clown. It's a theater, comrade major, not a circus. 
marking the waypoint. Whatever. I won't let that traitor get away from me again. Yeah, yeah. He called me a poopy head. Now he's gonna die. This is AK-47. Oh, hey. Ah, oh, fuck it up, right. Quickly, quickly, quickly. I hit some civilians. Come on. Yep. Oh. Gotcha. Suck my nuts. Hussy. If I hit this. Whoa. Oh, the hood flipped off. Eh. You. Uh oh. Get out, get out, get out. Eh. Do this red car. Is there any red cars I can hop into? I'm thinking so. Yeah, this way. Ooh. Very scary. Ooh, very scary. <sighs> on the road again, I got a way to go on the road again. Beep up, bleep up, bloop. I've got a gun and you don't, so blime a bam. Go suck your mom. It was a pleasure serving with you, Major P3. Unfortunately, you are about to be killed. Ah, you're so negative, Charles. I'm gonna die. I don't think maybe, though. I come through fast, man. Bam, 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 bam. Along, along the big comms, I should be Gucci. Yes, I do. There you go. Down the mine. Oh. What a douche. This is very loud. Oh, you went to it. Oh, you. Ugh. Okay, I think we have to be sat here. Give me a car. Give me something red so I can drive. Ooh, that music. I want to go up there and crash that whole thing down. Oh, dope. Seeing like the whole thing just destroy everything for miles. That would be really fucking sick. Oh god, yeah. Let's run, let's run, let's get one running. Come on, levels two. Ooh, that looks safe. Yeah, that might. Ew. Get inside. So, so, so you shit and leave out. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just getting started. Eat that toast sandwich. There's nothing in here. Why waste my time? Oh. Hi. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, damn myself over here. Mm, Suck him up. Homo sapien robot species to a sandwich, more trucker. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm stuck. Uh, oh, for fuck's sake. I'm dead. Oh, this works. 
Thank you. I got so fucking lucky with that. Holy shit. Yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. I thought it was Dunzo. Wowee. Eww. Is that the theater over there? The one with the vagina doors? Alright. This is death. Whoa, we're gonna, we're gonna find out. Oh. No death for me. Ha! Screw you. Ah, good. Don't know what that happened there. <laughs> oh, 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 fuck him. I sure am. Do you know where he is? I neither know. Oh, you shy to cut fucker. Sorry. Laura, I, I love your holiness, but it's not the now. The violent what? Honey, if you manage to catch that scumbag. Who is it? We whack her. Oh fuck it out. Tell her to miss the shotgun. You've attracted too much attention, Major. Things are about to get ugly. Not my fault. Play lots of puppies. Oh, I'm reloading. How about this? Oh, reload faster for the love of fuck. Come to Papa. Yeah. I knew that was gonna happen. Luckily, I saved. Ooh, I got sliced and diced. Yeah. At least I died. That's a good part. Me dying was part of the plan. Part of my soul society plan. To die and come back alive. Man, I am like Sosuke Aizen. I die and I survive. Now come to me, Nora. Are you trying to catch that rascal Petrov, sugar? Mm. I sure am. Do you know where he is? I neither know nor care. Filthy bastard. He wanted to subdue me. Mm, the violent abuser. Violent what? Honey, if you manage to catch that scumbag, give him to me. Oh, I would love to string him up and watch his head burst from too much blood. Yeah, sadly, no can do. The boss wants him alive and with his head intact, but... I'll rip his head off myself the moment we get the abort codes out of it. I will be happy to lend you a hand if you ask, handsome. Alright. Bad. <laughs> make some on the hand. I'll make some hammer. I'll save the fat boy stuff. Cause damn, he's a fat boy. What am I low on? 40-40. Nothing really. Eh, I'll hold on to it. But disassembling stuff, because I think the no thought. Um, yeah, these things. Yeah, all this stuff you could. I think they put some good slot into your butt guns and stuff. Just never had a chance to use them. And this one, if you slide into your gun cartridge, you'll do a fire boost. This one does an icy one. I would try them out, but I'm always needing stuff for health and ammo. I hope they give you more space. I know there's an upgrade for it. Oh, scary noises. Uh, 127. Oh, that's enough, isn't it? Yeah. Now I'll save onto that. Mm, shouldn't be the... I can... Yeah! Oh, that's so much more room! Oh! Get the, get the gun stuff. Um, I can get rid of one of the shotgun ones. And then we could try this um, cartridge stuff. 
This is zappy wand. This is freezy wand. Try fire wands first. Hell yeah. Let's just quickly save in case I die. One down. This is a good tactic. Right. Let's let's make haste. Make haste, fool. Make haste. Charles, how'd that whacked-out psycho Petrov manage to reprogram civilian robots to kill people? As I mentioned earlier. Victor Petrov is a talented engineer and programmer. Why didn't he use his talents to help people? We'll never know. Ooh, I got like a railgun. Yeah, railgun. Exactly. I had some fun once. Let's just leave him be, because I know it's gonna be a giant shitstorm of um, what the fuck. It's just... Hey! I keep getting timing wrong for that. Ooh, nice lake house. How fancy. You attack me? Don't attack me. Alright, chill. Saving data. Saving data. Thank you, Siri. Oh, wow. This is a theater? That looks nothing like a theater. It looks like there's outdoor ones from like ancient Greek. Oh, hello. Whoa. Holy shit. The submarine out water. What the fuck? Literally, they got this plant riven all over it. At least you just picked up a submarine, but dropped it in the middle of nowhere, put palm stuff all over it. Holding no shit on a cracker. Dope. Hey, where are we on his map? Oh, we're in the testing ground eleven. Yeah, I don't have to get into these. I mean, I'm not very really fast, to be honest. I'm going. I'm pre. I'm surviving on the stuff I got. If I, I if I able to open them while I'm there, I mean that's cool. I just want to see the story because it's interesting. I'm sure, most of it flies over my head, but you know, interesting stuff. Oh, ho, ho. I want this to come crashing down. I mean, who doesn't want that? I mean, who doesn't want to see that crashing down? I like the helicarrier. That's just dope. Oh, we got a fire coming, don't we, Nora? Alright. Please select the desired procedure. Oh yeah, I was gonna make the um, big boy next, the fat boy. Wasn't I? I remember I wanted to make this. As like big bad one. Let's just upgrade our stuff first, because I feel like we're gonna fight something. So, plus we've got tons of parts. No, nope. not enough. Use a polymer. I don't know. I don't know how to equip this. Does increase rate of fire though. For sure. Nope. Uh, nope. Nope. Again, I don't know what I'm doing with that, so I'm just gonna leave it. Ooh, can increase increase the magazine. Mm. The palm thing again. Again, I don't really know how to use that. And for the snowball. Eh. 
Maybe that's it. Is there like a way I could equip the palm and stuff? This probably is, I just don't know. Ooh, fist of eight now. Check out everything's fully loaded. Sure is. Alright, let's go. Yep, boss fight. Oh, it's a bailout. Crispy critters. An overgrown dumpling like that almost burned me down back in Forester Village. You're oh, yeah. On, comrade Major. We won't be able to enter the theater as long as the Beliash is guarding the entrance. We'll be That's inside cool. in five minutes flat. I can't, I can't. Okay. Uh, some enemies are resistant to regular frostbite. Use Palmer Jets to enhance the effects of freezing fire and electricity. See? I'm going to pay that thing back with interest. Oh, I don't have anything equipped though. Let us begin! Man. You're the man. I feel like there's a weak spot in the heads. That's a. Oh, I got one on the quick. Yeah. Ooh. Show me what you got. Show me what you got. I like to see what you got. Woo! Oh no, I'm gonna find one of these. Oh, whoa! Oh, this is shield one. Wait. Oh, I'm not ammo on this. Oh, shit. That's some nice damage. I was gonna case I'm all ammo and have this little thing. Oh, there's one. This is pretty easy. Do a lot better than I did with the uh Edge. Because it wasn't like running around like a Sonic on steroids or cocaine. Oh, that's no. Oh, flipping flapper, dude. A fireball rock throw. <laughs> oh, play for her. Yeah. Oh. Most damage, I think I was. Shit. Don't worry, I can do this. I can do this. I'm good. Fucked in the head. Still got 
pages left. Let's see what you got. Let's see what you got. I'll quickly load faster. Hold this for me, would you? How do you like that gear, head? Goes down. Oh, ho, ho, ho. So, yo, boom, you ought to see this. And then use the rest of the EMP on. Medium rare. Hell yeah. Give me your stuff. Ooh. That's fun. That would, oh god. When the boss fights come, they redo really do, do like make you feel like you're in doom or something. Please select the desired procedure. Alright, let me just get stuff out of my inventory. Good thing I stock these. Let's quickly craft some. I can't. La 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 la. Yeah, we're all going Amu. Ew. That was really fun. Damn. What? Is it underwater? Reach the theater. Oh, is it supposed to use like the camera to activate it? it? Might be something like that. I thought it was just gonna open. I thought this was the doorway, to be honest. Like it's like a secret passageway, and then you can twist like an egg. Might even do it like that. Cowardly fuck Petrov is hiding behind a dozen layers of robots. He is attempting to survive, but you're right, Comrade Major. Now that he's in the theater, he has nowhere to run. This is his last chance. He doesn't stand a chance in hell. True. Oi! What's the big idea? You're shooting at me. That's my fault. Ah, oh, lowers down. No cameras in the actual theater area. Hmm. Hog. Open that up. Maybe you're supposed to. Um. Hmm. That's testing ground eleven. I don't know. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm a bit, wee bit confused. Katoosh. Ooh, good stuff in here. Need that all this ammo I spent on that bomb. Boss fight. Give me all you good stuff. I got 100, 114 hang ammo. Holy shit. Ooh, I got stuff for the. Yeah. I got 125. I need to get ammo quick. Mad. I used to hang up for a little bit. I got quite a bit of ammo. 
I'm like a one-man one -man army at this point. Yeah, how do you get in here? If I use the Hulk? To like, find a way to open it? I don't get it. Oh! I didn't see this. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, Chopper. Very secret hit theater. Do you need to touch grass? Just, just saying. Not like that. I've, yeah, of course I've touched, I've touched grass myself. <laughs> right, down to the secret theater. Charles, can you track Petrov's whereabouts? Unfortunately, no. Petrov is no longer broadcasting. I will track him as soon as he does. Gotcha. That means he won't do it again. That dirty, rotten scum fuck is hiding away in some dark corner and he's gonna sit there and hope the robots kill me before I find him. I ought to warn you that Petrov knows this theater quite well. He has good reason to hope for such an outcome. Hope is dangerous. It'll lull him into a false sense of security. <laughs> Give me intel on the theater. The Maya Plisetskaya Theater was founded at the facility in 1948. It was the first theater in the world to use robots as performers. It is the most famous theater in the Soviet Union, so tickets can be quite hard to come by. Ooh. So it's for the rich and powerful. You have no idea. Before the theater was fully roboticized, party members would order the best ballerinas in the Soviet Union to be transferred here. But after the performers were replaced with robots, it became so successful, it's now easier to get an apartment near the Kremlin than it is to attend a performance here. Wow. Very expensive. Can you tell me anything more useful and less disgusting? As part of the facility, the theater is without a doubt a scientific establishment. Its artistic vein is melded with commerce, as is the study of robot behavior and human reactions to it. I have no combat-related data. Okay. How does Petrov know this theater so well? It was one of the areas his activities were focused on before he was declared a traitor. So, he's a nostalgic puppet master, huh? He configured and tested the theater's robots and also programmed and studied the interplay of various crafts. In a certain sense, Collective was born on the stage of this theater. How ironic. How'd that prick start working here? He was recommended by Comrade Stockhausen. Oh yeah, no wonder. They're both lousy pieces of shit. Pardon me, but I fail to understand why you put Comrade Stockhausen on the same level as a traitor. Hang on. How'd Petrov manage to butter up Sechenov? Did that lickspittle Stockhausen recommend him to the boss too? Victor Petrov optimized the robot control loading protocols. Data loading speed was tripled. That was when Comrade Stockhausen recommended Petrov to Dr. Sechenov. Hmm. Shouldn't have done that. True. Let's go see what's what. Yeah, yeah. This plane is theater. Macbeth. Quick save. Thank you. Your cue, comrade major. Are you here to finish me off, dog? Then come on down. I am all yours. Ooh. A man who likes to play. What? Who said that? Oh! <gasps> Woo! Ballerina! But you know my girl, so. You can take me as a conversation partner. I'm good. You may be a ballerina, but you're not the ballerina twin, so. No. You're like a dog. Your master sits oh. on someone and you go right for the throat. <laughs> Just do it. And do it. Oh Gosh, shit, EMP. Oh, 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 it's a trap. Son of a bitch. 
I'm still gonna get you! Hang on, Comrade Major. I'll try to reduce the charge. Whoa! I don't care if I got a crop. I'm gonna get that motherfucker. Oh! I've reduced the charge. Are you okay, Comrade Major? Bad worse. Much oh. worse. He's not getting away from me. The way they can fly. Hot head. Okay. Ooh. Very nice, you can electrify the floor. Oh, this open up now. Lord, how may I entertain you? Shall we have a chat? Let can you dance for me? Stop dance. To Maya Plusetskaya, robotic theater. Home of the world's first troupe of robotic performers. <clears throat> Lovely. Hello there. Buy tickets in advance for our spectacular performance. Heart of the robot, a peaceful atom. <laughs> Doesn't seem all that peaceful to me. Emotional Beautiful. thrill guaranteed. The play features fine humor, epic battles, fantastic Bonda. special effects, and a touch of heart-wrenching drama. Beautiful. Uh, I get enough of that in real life, thanks. Visit the box office so you won't miss the best performance of 1955. Yeah, bye. 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 Oh, look at the nipple action. Ooh. The Bonda graphics on that is mad. It's sublime. Oh. Fading data. Very fancy. Mm. Darling, when will you finally kill that scumbag Petrov? How long are you going to keep chasing him? Uh, don't rub it in. I'm sick and tired of that deranged bastard. He made his stupid robots kill people. Now it's so difficult to find enough people to string up. Change the subject or shut your face. Do you love me, sugar? Yes. Tell me. You could enter me more often. Yeah, right. Even more often, huh? There isn't enough polymer in the world to satisfy you. I'm a woman who appreciates the finer things, sugar. And I don't come cheap. Oh, there's so much more I wish I could do for you. But if you want me to give it my all, it's gonna cost you. Yeah, I noticed. Does it feel good to be with me, handsome? Yeah, I'm over the fucking moon. Now get on with it. Oh, what a brutish rough male. Oof, I'm on fire. When is this shit gonna end? Never. Can't enter it though. At first I'm like, oh, you make me uncomfortable. But now I'm like, mm, yes, delectable. I feel like I'm not gonna use this shit though. I don't know how to use it. I might as well just spend it. We'll keep some in storage just in case, but I'm not planning on using it. I feel like I get by with this already. Anything from lots of it. Nope. I just focus on saving up for the big boy, the fat boy. 175. Ooh, nice. Alright. Let me get you. Both storage ones are fully done. Allows you to swap weapons quickly. Hmm. 
won't live by the shield wand. Actually, let's just save it. Oh, wait. Wow, we got a lot of space. Yes. How much space do I have left now? I still got a full row. Wow, that's a lot. I'm never gonna run out of ammo or health again. Good idea to put that in. Oh, you spawn top of your head now. Oh, you're a horrible hive. Well, that's not good. You're dead, motherfucker. You're taking more to kill. Oh, I guess the back is really spot out. The stage has been set. The Opera Theatre. Oh, oh aim on point. Well, it's gonna be like some Beethoven music to find the boss here, isn't it? Music is hard. Not today. Oh, clown. I'm not going to hell, thank you. Boom! Oh, it's a donkey. You lady good? Just look, you escaped out of hell. Literally, health like, down there. Right, that's the way to proceed. So, let's go down here. Yeah. Oh. of goodies. Mm -hmm. I'm over this door which I don't know how to lock. Um, still don't know how what I'm doing with those. To the first floor. Alright, get to the third floor, that's the main objective. Chill. Yes, 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 yes. Whoopsie. I messed up this one in a while. I know what I'm doing here. Hey, 
Okay, guys. See, if you don't know what you're doing, spread random bombs till it works. Alright, that's the way to the first floor. Oh, fucking cocksucker, motherfucker. Ooh, Shizer. Look my massive fat titties, bitch. I mean, go to the gym, but... Thank you. Thank the gym. Oh, I hate those robots. Chopo. Yep. Here, please don't welcome you to a roboticized theater. It's the first of its kind in the world, and it's based on your design. I've made a few little tweaks here and there, of course. Comrade Sechenov, Comrade Zahara, please follow me. What a wonderful evening, Dimitri. What an incredible performance. I propose a toast to Vossov. Science has never been so close to, uh, triumph. Cheers. Oh, that's it? Oh, I thought it was more. Right. Where do guys like Petrov even come Ooh. from in a flourishing society like ours? Whoa, oh, I fucking slooch. God damn it. Well, maybe I got this. How much damage is this? Where is he? He does a bit more damage. Okay. That must be a pain. Gross, like a blow of my There's another one of these things I have to take it down. Oh shit. Oh you're sucking dick suck. Some massive pile of dicks. I mean it goes those damage here, but not much. I guess I can use a little bit of it. Oh, nice. I'll use these little ones first. Little one. Remember that? There you go. all the, uh, things. I think so. Oh no. I'm just dealing with the, with the, the small new small new ones. I think that's all of them. Alright. No, oh, give me the snowball. There we go. Let's go. The beast is dead. I feel like a bot fight, just punch and punch and punch and punch till your face is covered in sweat, piss and blood. Bucky's fucking dope though. Fucking love Bucky. Can't wait for the part 2 of Bucky Hammer, see Pickles. Yeah, you see Bucky Hammer, watch it. Watch it all reading, it is fucking dope. It's like JoJo's office of the North Star. Men just fucking beating each other half to death. And it's fucking ridiculous at times. Even JoJo was weird. We see some shit that happened to Bucky. Crap. Ooh. Oh, got touched to death by the host. Like, literally, the amount of shit that happened to Bucky is ridiculously stupid and awesome at the same time. That, R that L2 charge is really handy. Oh yeah. Definitely good idea. 
Good thing I went with Snowball. Shall we, gentlemen? Ooh. 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 Oh, so close. Like this. Hmm. There, there we go. Like I said, keep pressing buttons, something good will happen. Teddy Hall. Fuck, that's dark. Oh, facing the wrong way. Have you found Petrov's trail, Comrade Major? I've driven him into a trap. He's got nowhere to run. Is Dr. Filatova with him? No, Petrov's alone. Aren't you maybe just a little too interested in what happens to her, Stock? You didn't happen to betray your friend because of her, did you? You just crossed the line, Major P3. I demand that you cease these outrageous oh. insults at once. And I no. demand that you shut up and stop annoying me with this existence. I am carrying out the order of Dr. Petrov. Wants to know when you deliver the trough to him. Your protege has nowhere to run. He's gone nuts. He's watching you through the cameras, reciting poetry, and screaming hysterically into the loudspeaker. I'll take him alive within the hour. Try not to fail, Dmitry Sergeyevich, at least this time. Fuck you. Fuck you. You shouldn't behave like this. Comrade Stockhausen is blameless. He is genuinely trying to help. Yeah, right. He's genuinely trying to steal Petrov's woman. Okay. I might. I think I turned down a little bit. It was a bit loud. Even though I'm like five episodes in, saying that. Super. This is Stockhaus. Big to confess this slander of Comrade Sechenov. He's already starting to rally a large number of followers and is planning to destroy Soviet society's faith in the better future that is collective. Yes, I have the record. Tomorrow at the Botanical Garden. Ascend in the Department of Corrections. The cash will be fine. Thank you. Dirty, disagree. Ooh, interesting. Let's read this. I must admit, Victor, you're talented. People can say what they will about your ideal idiosyncrasy. I think that's pronounced it right. Shall we call them? Um, but your skills are unde undeni un undeniable. Your work with the neural network and robots. You could write text boxes, textbooks about it. I never noticed your abilities before. What's your secret? Is this your new Palmer Parma 
para armor giving some new additional motivation. But some, but that's not of my concern. I've got good news. I've gotten you quite the promotion. We'll celebrate your lofty new position as soon as you can figure the new norm, neuro polymers from po the power of, of data exchange. I owe you a mug for a for your favorite Bavarian beer. Hooray! Promotion. Let's do this puzzle. What do we have here? Mm. La 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 Needs to be the top one, so... Oh, uh, like you? I have done it. Oh. Hmm. It's good, but not good enough, so... Yeah! I did some oh fucking cocksucker motherfucker! Ooh, you sizing dick bag! This. God, I always find it funny how every time I swear, I'm always like saying, "Oh, you swear, 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 bleep, 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 bleep words." So I'm saying, "Ah, oh, you scared me." Now nah, I just, I just curse people half to death. That's my ability. Look, I have my, my excuse is I'm British, so I have perfect I have every right to say it. Bloop. Oh no, I need the first floor. That's where we were. That's the first floor. Can I go to fourth floor? What's up with the fourth floor? Oh, this is the first floor. Oh, that must have been the second floor then. Alright. Ooh. Sweet. Saving data. Saving data. Optimization. Sweet. Oh, actually, that's, um... Send more stuff. Where's that condensed... Oh no, I haven't moved into my storage yet. Move. Move. And. Move you. And move you. And all this. Now. Disassemble you. And you. And one of you. I'd like to upgrade. Yes. Damn it, yes. More damn dams. Have your thing. Never mind. Wait, can I upgrade the... No. I feel like I'm in Hawaii while I listen to this. Hundred and eighteen. I want to finish off this branch first since it's the closest one. You can use neuro capsules one handed. Okay. Allows you to swap hundred percent more quicker with weapons or use medical supplies allows you to fully regenerate in a matter of seconds. I might save it for this one. This one's really good. I'll save I'll save for that one.
we need just a bit more Palmer, so I'll probably just go around a few more safe points and farm. I had to do it. I had to. Sechenov is going to kill us all. He's toying with us and with you too. Oh, hello. Yeah, I'm not listening to what you're saying, dude. I'm just like doing shit. Judge not, lest ye be judged. Look around you and see the lies for what they are, or the truth will catch you unawares. You hear me? You care. Mine was I'll, not I'll, the original I'll, sin. I want to all started her. with setting off. I want to erase. I was just an unsuspecting victim. To cherish. And no one can stand in our way. All the world's a stage, and all the men and women merely players. And that includes me. I'm going to play my greatest role here at this theater. My robots blisters. It'll be the greatest show of all time. Special day that will become momentous indeed. And the whole world drown in blood. Just need to survive until the until the day when the collective updates the version 2.0 and shatters into a million pieces. That's when we'll take the greatest step in our lives in the race out. Ah. Yes, my precious. Uh, well, boy, he's a little fellow. That's from the mirror, isn't it? <laughs> so a bit cuckoo. Um, oh, there we go. Um, Alina, have you heard? They're going to be a party VIPs at the show tonight. They say Comrade Molotov is going to stop by. I really want to impress him, especially since you and I are going to get kicked out and replaced by machines pretty soon. And we used to be the prime ballerinas, so I've got my sights set on Molotov. I need to get into a backstage party tonight, for art's sake. Okay, I'm still going to think that um, the dude who's been like our sort of father figure is going to betray us, or has been using us. I don't know, it just seems like that's what it's saying. That's what it's setting up to be. I'm gonna get down. Do I just jump down? Yeah. Ooh. Okay, the banner is bold to open the gate. You miserable dog! Chicken. I will show you the duality of this world. It's a candle. A of perspective, isn't it? Uh oh. Do you decide what to do? Or is Whoa. it decided for you? It oh, doesn't matter shit. which side you see you from. Top or bottom. Right. I'm gonna be brainless mutt. You'll never understand. Oh camera. I'm just getting started. Yep. Yeah. Here we go. Go, 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 go. They don't. Oh, for fuck's sake. You can preach, you can move a light. Right. Oh, no, 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 Oh my god, fuck's sake. Nope. Nope. Oh god, you guys are health melters. Yeah. the last one. There you are. But that's so annoying when you get stuck behind something, even though you can clearly move it. Like this. Like, you can clearly move that. Stupid chicken. 
This one is a bit obvious, you gotta just move it and you're stuck behind this sort of stuff and just get crowded. It's a bit stupid. Oh my god. Uh, repair it. Right, I got the worst aim ever. What? Oh. Mutiny. Do you even know what happiness is? That's mighty profound, you sick fuck, but it won't help you. How the hell could I even know if I was happy or not? I wish I did, but here we are. Everybody here. The world's the law. Sorry, Blake. My wife's sick. Sorry, Blake. My wife's sick. And I had to pick my kids up from daycare and... It's okay, Gunstead. We get it. Have a seat. Yeah, thanks. Sorry. Well then, comrade. Why have I brought you all together at such a late hour? <laughs> How much longer will we tolerate the yoke of bourgeois vice in this sacred home of art? <laughs> How much longer will the gluttonous despot fray our nerves and pull our strength like a perverted puppet master? How much longer will there be foul fingers? Uh, uh, sorry, I got a tight way. What I wanted to say is, Lars Dutchkin is an asshole. But my friend, so we can't just sit back while our girls and some of our boys get turned into bourgeois prostitutes. Well now, what do we have here? Boy, very good. Ah, and girls too, eh? Uh, arrest them. Ooh, someone's was a mutiny. As I say, walk the plank, oh get bum fucked. Alright. This is the way we this way we can get on here. Uh, okay, that's the way to continue. That's it, so let's just see what was, what was the end. Again? Where's the way I just literally came out from? Over here. Bingo. I don't know what's over here, but we can see. Uh. Are you dead? Alive or dead? What's the difference? We're all just electrical stream. Just ones and zeros? Every power outlet knows that. One, five, zero, six? Oh, one, five, zero, six. That's, that's code for something. One, five, zero, six. One, five, zero, six. Um, okay, I'm not really know that, but it's just a bunch of stuff. This debt accrued last week. All right, one five zero six, one five zero six. That's a code for something. One five zero six. I miss you. Yeah, one five zero six. Our girls are suffering. Our girls are suffering. How are they supposed to get on stage after that? They're absolutely devastated. Have we gotten about art? Those sweaty party leaders have no interest in art. The fat bastards just want to get their rocks rocks off backstage. They can't keep off they can't keep their pulls off the girls. The poor poor things are suffering. Their Soviets are malfunctioning. 
the software is glitching out the poor, poor deers. We need to do something about it. What was the code again? I fucking forgot. Alive or dead? What's the difference? We're all just electrical. Five one zero six. Business first. Five one zero six. Five one zero six. Five one zero six. Let's get me pulling for something. Five one zero six. Five one zero six. Charles. Yes, Major. Oh. Five one zero six. Petrov's lost his shit. Following an analysis of Petrov in light of his recent quarrel with Larissa Filatova, I have drawn the same conclusion. You analyzed him? It's a common scenario. He loved her. Their perspectives on life grew apart. She ended the relationship. He lost his mind. Huh. He got dumped. I guess. What kinds of shows do they put on here? Primarily ballet. A performance entitled Heart of the Robot, A Peaceful Atom, has been particularly popular recently. A celebratory performance is planned here in honor of the launch of Collective 2.0. Space-based programs honoring the first Soviet citizen in space will come later. We'll see. This place is pretty messed up right now. Say, are the... Ballerinas here. Just ballerinas. The topic of robosexuality is extremely popular among the Soviet hey. Robosexual lobbies have become quite powerful. And it would seem that the sale of related services is flourishing at the theater. In other words, no. The ballerinas are not just ballerinas. Oh man. Damn it. I mean, that, I mean, that's a good thing, though, right? The ballerinas are not just ballerinas, so... Mm. Do you think the boss knows about this? What do you think? Well, given the robots he's chosen as bodyguards, guess he's a robosexual himself. According to Ozhigov's Dictionary of the Russian Language, the word robosexual is a facetious term for a person who enjoys intimate relations with machines. Generally, while manipulating... Okay, I get it. He can go ahead and manipulate whatever he wants. What he does with those androids of his is none of my business. But I gotta admit, they are kinda hot. Hell yeah, my P3 know what's up. Stand down for now. Hush. Hush. Bro, my man know what's up. Bro, that's weird though. At, like, at some point in the future, we're gonna have that, like, that, politi that political discussion about robo's sexuality like have a thing for robots it's gonna happen in the future it's gonna be like that like the episode of futurama where they had to like get a degree of like able to marry robots or stuff like that like nowadays it's all about like homosexuality but in like who knows like 20 10 20 years if ai gets more that advanced it's gonna be a point where it's gonna be like well can we can we fuck a robot it's mad. Select the desired procedure. It's weird to think about that. But they talk about it now, but we should, we could be talking about it like ten years and have this sort of stuff. Ooh, I'm like, I'm eleven off. So close. It's mad though. Interesting concept that I like to see more about. You know, because you, you, I love seeing that sort of like political side of futuristic robots. Like, how would it influence? Like the world and all this old stuff. What the fuck is this? Did someone just not in here? Ew. But it's interesting to think about it. Plus, I'll I'll be probably robo section myself if I had ballerinas on with me. I mean, who, who, I mean, come on. Who wouldn't? It's kind of what they did in Detroit as well. Become human. That's why I really enjoy it. Just because of that, that interesting side of when will AI become so advanced that they'll be us at, some, at one point. Because that has happened before. Um, I don't know if you knew, but like scientists like a few years back did make two um, robots talk in like ones and zeros. So it made them like like 100% like make conversations. But at, at one point, the AI just got involved and made their own language. So then... Um, 
the people had to close down immediately, realizing that they could like do that sort of weird shit. Crazy thing about ads. It's kind of scary, but in a cool way. I keep getting so close to this one. Oh, I'm gonna get this right. Uh, oh. Oh, it changes. Oh! I didn't know it changes. the wrong direction the, the wrong direction not the one direction <laughs> do you like it dog <laughs> like how i remade this place dude's I fucking off his rockers yeah he's good he's good he's tapped bro when we fight him he's gonna be dead oh i I'm just calling it now, he's going to be off his case when we see him. He's slowly, slowly losing it. I know being single is not, I know being single is sad, it's not the end of the world. I've been doing fine. Physically at least. Mentally, I'm keeping it together. It's not like amazing being single, but you know, nothing to get like crazy about it. Sure, you miss a touch of woman, but you got Mr. Left Hand to help you out there. Anywho, before it gets weird, Chopper. Off, you're done with the sillage. Those party members can do whatever the fuck tickles their fancy, but you? What? You haven't got fucked up by electricity in your life? 
So you want to get revenge by fucking it back? Anyway, I saw you making googly eyes at that doll in the dressing room. She's a bot, Vasilich. A robot. People keep asking me, hey, why is that electrician always in the co tech room? Why isn't he working? I ain't gonna cover your ass no more. Aren't you ashamed of yourself? You're making us both look bad. Yeah, dude. Don't fuck the robots, man. What the fuck, Richard? Ooh. Uh, what was it? Zero, oh, yeah. Six, 15. How am I supposed to enter it? The password appears not to be a password at all. Oh. It was zero. Fuck, what was the password again? I fucking forgot. It was z 1506. So, one, one, two, three, five, zero. Yeah, you give me 1506. 1506. Yeah. Maybe one. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, one, five, zero, six. So one, five, zero, one, five, zero. I know what I'm doing here, man. I need a bunch of lights. Not Christmas affair. Find somewhere find someone who knows the code. Oh. The electrician is the only one who knows the code for this door. Damn it's obvious. Electrician only okay, so you need to find the electrician. So how did you give up the ghost? Was it mutants? Electrocution, damn it! Oh. So are you the electrician? No, I'm not. Not if you're fine. Silage, you put him down like a fucking dog. You hear me? Kill that lousy egghead. Oh, he's one to be fucking the robots. That yeah, will do after he gives me the code. He keeps hammering about electricity. You know it when you meet him. The electrician is the only one who knows the code for this door. Is yeah, he where he is? Yeah, so where do I find him? So where do I find him? Fuck the vinyl. The okay. Is the only one who knows the code for this door. <laughs> okay, that's enough. For now, right. anyway. Electrician. Wait, we have no idea where he is. Have we been over there? I see a sorry ass. God, don't, don't possess the cow. Please move him, bucko. Go face off a mutant cow. Got to find an electrician. You could have been a happy man, Major. Retire. Get yourself a, a Katya or a Tanya. But me, I could have done the same. Look for the electrician. Right in there, but it's... oh, there's a candle in there. We need that. I'm watching you, Bucko. Uh. I don't know if these guys are chill or not. Some of them are, some of them aren't. I mean, it looks chill. Oh. Bizies. Oh, we're back here. Oh. If I were a electrician who likes to bang a robot, where would I be? I guess I could talk to any dead corpses. He 
you look at sh you look like a, sh a, sh a shoulder a soldier. You're not him. Mm. Pitch black in there. No. Just oh, what? Where I just was? Oh. Oh, 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 oh! I was supposed to be prima ballerina. Me! If I ever get my hands on you, I'll choke the life out of you. Don't make me laugh, prima. You failed even at croaking first. They always do that. Even as I lay dying, keep your flippers to yourself. Hey, you! Yes, you! Which of us died in a prettier way? Was it me? Um, I don't know. Let's see. She died in a more dramatic pose. She died more normally. And then you know the cliche way of like dying, like eh. And she just fell on the ground. Hmm. I like yours. Uh, I think you died more expressively. Merci. I told you. Ha! Just what I expected from a military grunt. Go away. I was supposed to be prima ballerina. Yeah, you're just Me. Being it. Okay, that's it. I'm done with this. Um, miss you as well. Yeah, pretty sneaky. Technician. Technician. If I were a technician, where would I be hiding after I died and bombed a robot? You're, te you're not a technician. Where would he be? So it's everywhere. Is it you? You don't have the thing on you, so no. No, no. The electrician's the only one who knows the code for this door. Gab is on. Okay, that's enough. For now, anyway. <sighs> where, where, where would it be? Seriously lost. Find someone who knows the, the code. Yeah, the electrician, but where is he? Check here. I was previously. I have to go. Maybe I have to go. Maybe I have to backtrack a little bit. You are an electrician now. Alive or dead? What's the difference? We're all just electrical stream, just ones and zeros. Every power outlet knows that. One five zero six zero six fifteen. What's that? A code or oh. something? Are you dumb? It is the date of the new concert. Everybody knows that. Even simple electricians know that. Oh. oh, oh, oh. Would a simple electrician know the door code? The code? How did it go? One moment. Top button on the right. Or was it left? The bottom. Le left one. I bet. Or was it both? Mm. Well, shit. What was it again? I've spoken. Crispy critters. Oh, shit. Alive or dead? What's the difference? Does the world grow? 0615? What's that? A code or something? Are you dumb? It is the date of the new concert. Oh, God. So... Are you the electrician? I could be. Or I could be a wild, unrestrained energy current. Tell me the code, current. Or what? Are you gonna kill me? Piss off. Uh, da, 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 don't be so mean. What's oh. the code? Oh! I don't know this. It is the date of the new concert. <laughs> What a simple electrician code? How did it so, go? Bottom Top button on the right, right. Or was it left? The bottom. Le 
Left one. A dead? Or was it both? Ooh. Well, shit. What was it again? I've spoken. Crispy critters. Okay, I... Let's just, let's just speak back to the dude. He might know. The bot, top bottom on the left? Oh, I have to be dead. That's the wrong way. Boys, this way. Six and a half hours later. Oh, wait a sec. I, I just noticed this. Thought. Um. I've been doing this for like the past like 10 15 minutes going back and forth figuring out what the fuck am I supposed to be doing? I've been trying to remember what this guy's been saying, but no, the code's right next to him. It's the two on the top and then one on the bottom. I'm so dumb. God, I'm more retarded than a spoon. There's top two on the top and then one on the left. My god. Uh, Attention a span of a form Felis. Ugh. Probably should be the ones I like, the ones who snap my fingers. It's you, you, and you. That took me way too long to figure out. Jesus. But now we're finally in and making progress. Alright, there's, the thing, there's two things to read. Number one, Stimpan, I've talked to a few of the ballerinas and coat check girls, and you're right. They would like to make a few extra rumbles to set to set up a gentleman's club backstage. I get 10% cut. P.S. The week's password is loop. Alright, and what's this one then? This one, I can't read anything. Alright. All the time. What do we have here? Oh, blue. Ooh. This one. And you. Bingo. I'm so good. I did within 10 moves. I'm just built different. Oh, now we can access this one. Act 1 Space Odyssey. Duration 30 minutes. Precursor required one energy element. Start show. What? <laughs> get the ball get the ballerina's ball. Oh wait for the performance to end. I saw you piece of shit Wayne. Oh, where'd he come from? Ow. Okay, my bad. I got greedy. Oh, that was quick. Yeah. Give me the ball. Give me a dragon ball. when they put like beta music behind like three key other scenes like this like films it's kind of funny you see like disaster everywhere and it's just really joyful music fucking hell Ooh. 
you. I'm saying hello to my little friends. La 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 What the? What happens here? Let's come low beat. Oh, hello. I'm taking this music. I saw the dog step you like. Someone dubs that Beethoven. Hello. Pretty good. I fucking die. Oh fuck me. Nope. Nope. Nah. Nah. Suck your mom. Fuck you. Oh, why she give me like a grenade or something? Oh shit! What the fuck? Fuck off! God! What the fuck is happening, man? Thank you. Got the candle. Now we're fucking off. I'll grab all that stuff, but fuck that. Charles, what did you just turn on? A temporary malfunction, Major. I am now operating within normal parameters. Oh, you're a tough nut Ooh. to crack. Oh, I can't even soften you up. Sectional says, seek him. And you can't disobey! That's fine. Solve my puzzle, P3. I'll try to reach you. I'm stuck! One last step in a dead body, please! I don't want this! I need a dead body! I, I can feel it beginning to decompose! Enough! Turn it off! And I don't want this! We're searching off real plan is going to take us. You'll find the campus right here. Oh! I have several questions. What the hell was that? Charles? What? I don't know what you mean, Comrade Major. The chirper you found is broken and silent. What the fuck was that? The woman again from the with memory sequence. The child laughing. God, that turns to a horror game. Although, I do wish I had a bit of horror into it. Like the first scene we saw Nora. That was really spooky. I wish I had more of that in it. The action is really fun, but having that horror part will make it even better. Like seeing that little ominous shadow in the background and then when you turn away it's gone. That I wanna see more of that. Kinda like when you do a FNAF. Final way to open the gate. Like no like is there like a turn on switchy thingy? Oh. Press like this. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Your move, Charles. I'm kind of out of my depth here. 
Oh, maybe we got to um, make his suit. Ah, I think we got to figure out here. Yeah. in the fourth position. Maybe we got to make it like make like his stabbing it, the 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 dude. Releve in the fingers. Anything else worth checking out? Attitude. Attitude. Maybe like that one, like stabbing him. Done already? Oh my, you're down. Anything here. else worth checking out? This isn't new to you though, is it? Back to more tall dudes with arms free. Repeated all around us? Anything else worth checking out? Clear sky. Attitude. Yeah, like stabbing him from there. Let's fly her out. Unless you want to hear the heavy footfalls of the robot army. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. This is your time to shine, Charles. You're a smart ass machine, right? So we're well, gonna do a two for one. Smart ass commands for you to figure out. Not gonna lie, this Petrov did not shut up. Allah second, arms free. It's a good one. Let's just try to see other ones. We'll try again. Give her a command. Ekate with the right leg. No. Try again. Give her a command. If I'm right about this, that'd be pretty good. Nope. Try again. Get a bunda though. Look at bunda. Nah, it's top one. Try again. Give her a command. Yeah. That's, that's a clever way of doing it. It's like. Yeah, I don't care what you're saying, but I like these sort of shadow puzzles. Like the DM Resident Evil 7. I like that. That one's fine. So I'll do this one. Ballerina's training is proceeding magnificently. We just need to show them the proper ballet positions. It's a shame they aren't connected to the primary neural network. Just imagine what we could teach them. And most importantly, no polymer injection whatsoever. Truly fantastic women. Just say the name of the position and that's it. And it doesn't have to be a ballet position. Okay. Don't know what that means, but boop. Debug mode initiated. Please enter a command. Uh, I don't really get this stuff. Want to give it a whirl, Charles? Um, try attitude again. Attitude? No. Let's try a different one. If I'm right about this, I'll be very smart. Classe in the fifth position, arms in the third position. Close. Let's try a different one. Passe. No. Let's try a different one. You have no idea how many first arabesque. Nah. Let's try a different one. Do shut up. Attitude. Powerlessness. Wasn't you. Let's try a different one. Classe in the fifth position. Arms it could be that one. Position. The way, like, stabbing from the top. Okay, that's tempting. Let's try a different one. So it was um, this one. So what about passe? Passe. Close, but not really in the belly. Let's try a different one. First arabesque. No, it's gonna be the middle Let's one. Try a different one. So this one. Classe in the fifth position. Arms in the third position. Did that do it? Oh, they move? No? Oh, I didn't do this one now. Oh, that was just did myself. Mode initiated. Please yeah. Yeah. Charles, do me a favor. Okay. Um, yeah, right, let's see. First arabesque. Nope. Try another one. No. Try another one. Attitude? No. Releve in the fifth position. FSA, yeah. Arms upright and loosen and elongate your eyes. Yeah, I was right. Oh, way to go. Dude, I'm so smart. Collects was supposed to be a real show. And now no one will ever see it. in the theater. Except a stray dog. Oh, dude, I was, I was smart. I was just guess that. Because I had a feeling it was supposed to be... Something like that, like using 
that sort of technique with the shadows because I love those shadow puzzles. That's so clever. I love shadow puzzles. They're so good. It makes you really rethink outside the box. So I remember the shadow puzzles from Resident Evil 7, Biohazard. I think it'd been 8 as well. Where you have to use like the puzzles to proceed with the game. So I was like, hmm, maybe that's how to do something with it. And I was right. Bang on the money. Yeah, Charles, why is that head case whining about how Collective is going to kill us all? I can't stop thinking about it. Could Collective really be dangerous? Of maybe it could be right. Not. Collective cannot be dangerous. That's all there is to it. Only its owner can be dangerous. I mean, when you think about it, if you controlled it to self-destruct, then blow off their heads off. Or send signals like brainwaves in the head to be violent. Like in Kingsman. Kingsman's a funny film. You mean his discretionary authority? Indeed, it exists. There is no getting around it. The Alpha Connector, the one that gives you total control over Collective. There's only one of them. You said that yourself, right? Indeed. What conclusion do you draw from that? As long as Dr. Sechenov has the Alpha Connector, we got nothing to worry about. Is that well, do we? Of course. Dr. Sechenov is as honest as the day is long. He's a hero of the Soviet Union. A genius who made our country what it is today. You know the boss better than me, Charles. I sincerely hope you're right. What's that supposed to mean? It means that too much has happened over the last 24 hours. All these events force one to see things from a different perspective. Like what? Consider this. What will happen if the Alpha Connector winds up in the hands of a man who wants to enslave the entire world? Exactly. Dr. Sechenov would never let that happen. Molotov's dead, and nobody else would take it from him. And even if someone did, they couldn't do shit before Monday. And after that, it'll be protected by the whole collective network. Perhaps. But Dr. Sechenov will also control every aspect of the network's security apparatus. Yeah, I guess so. So you've also come to stuff. realize that Dr. Sechenov will not destroy the Alpha Connector after Collective launches. That's why you said that the Connector would be protected, isn't it? Well... Maybe he needs discretionary authority for his brilliant research and stuff. Why would his research require that? Would people connected to Collective really refuse any practical request made by the man who catapulted them into the next phase of evolution? Would you, Comrade Major? Well... I... Yeah, I mean, I... Ooh, he's making him question himself now. Petrov's close. Any suggestions? In regard to your question, Victor has made a number of significant alterations to the theater. Arresting him will not be easy, even in light of his obvious psychological. Don't feel like he's going to be dead again. And we'll try fight to him. avoid the Vova's attacks. As for your own condition, I have one thing to say. There, there. <laughs> there, there. Take his, take that there, stick off the sun don't shine. Take your there, there, and stick it where the sun don't shine. Such fanciful functions do not exist in my code base. Ah, oh, there, there. <laughs> Why all this art and murder? What's that little weasel up to? I have run a diagnostic on your body. My access to certain internal components is blocked. Hypothetically, Petrov could be attempting to interact with these components in order to influence you. Like you, he is in a state of extreme psychological tension. Ooh, internal components? What internal components? There are blank areas concealed from my diagnostic algorithms. They could be polymer cavities caused by repeated use of the glove's abilities. Or they could be bullet wounds in your head. That would make sense with the whole amnesia thing. Crispy critters. You think I've got a goddamn bullet lodged in my brain? I Pretty cool. could perform a deeper analysis, but the brain diagnostics amnesia. could cause pain, vomiting, loss of consciousness, and extended migraines. Stay out of my head, Charles. I'll get a checkup after we get back from the mission. Nobody's gonna own Collective. Dr. Sechenov is gonna launch it and everybody's gonna be equal. Brilliant scientists like him are above power struggles and other petty bullshit like that. Hmm. I don't know. We just have to see. Please select the desired procedure. Ooh, lots of goodies.
Um, still got not enough. Actually, before we do anything else, let's. Anything to storage? Yes. Stuff out of you. Right. Great time. Yeah. Mm hmm. Should I have enough now for the thing I want? Yes. Was this one? Yes. Alright. Nice. So I'm going to finish up this branch first since I only got achieved three more, four more upgrades. All like, and they're all relatively cheap. So I'll finish up this branch. I'll be after the unit. Actually, I should see if I can craft anything. Access granted. I'll make two rounds of you. Authorization made. And then two rounds of you. Just make sure I'm all top top on guns. Whoops. So, what will it be, Major? And then two rounds on shotguns. Just one then. Right. We find him soon, so. Right here, actually. And again, another Nora. So, boss fight coming. Let's just quickly check. Alright, let's do this. Hello? Oh no. You won't yep. fool me again. You're mine now, shitbird. Hear that, fuckhead? Show us over. Over music. There you are. Always breathing down my neck. Where's the doctor? Larissa, she... She dumped me. Unbelievable. Yep. I don't know where she is. Maybe she's there. This is terrible, Barinas. He didn't believe such enough, did he? Molotov's dead. Then it all makes sense. What makes sense? Collective will activate. And that's the end of everything. What? What's wrong with people controlling robots with their minds? You're the one who created the goddamn system, you prick. I had no idea what Sechnov was planning to do with it. Unlike you, he wasn't planning to kill anybody. <laughs> oh, really? You believe that? Then why did all those peaceful robots start hacking everyone Because to you reprogrammed them, that's why. <laughs> Are you serious? How stupid can you get? Do you have any idea how long it takes to write a functional algorithm for a single robot? And there are dozens of models here. So what? <laughs> I'll tell you what. Combat mode was programmed into them during the initial design phase. And sure, no one ever thought it'd be activated here in the Soviet Union, and that was totally on me. 
But I can assure you that Sechenov's plans are far, far worse than this. And he has to be stopped! Bullshit! I'm sick of this crap. You're gonna tell me right now how to switch the robots out of combat mode. <laughs> Sorry. That's not gonna happen. Hell it will. <laughs> I've already put everything into motion. Stop! This was supposed to be I said a stop. special day for oh, us. Oh no, what's gonna happen? I was going to propose to her the day Collector was launched. It was going to happen right here in the theater. House of Bob. Watch out, your hands! Give this to Larissa. <sighs> oh! Shit! Oh fuck, that's not good. No. Not good. You clown. Well, you definitely dead this time. Shit. P3 to Chilome. Come in, Chilome. Finally. Do you have Victor? Petrov killed himself in a creative way, and I couldn't stop him. Damn! Is his head intact? Yes. I'm looking at it right now. Keep oh, clean. the safe, P3. I'll send you a special container. Put it inside, and the rest will be done automatically. Right. Carry that. Hi, how are you? Wrong. Whoa, 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 what's happened? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Where do we go now? Team saved. I thought we were gonna fight him in like a big mech suit or something. Oh, if he predid this. Oh, pause. We'll be fine, that thing. Shy, but we'll work out the kinks as we go. After all, there's nothing to do with a little kink, is there? It is my great pleasure to present to you the lovely Natasha. Natasha. Whoa! Oh, that's big a huge bitch. Oh, Jesus Christ. I guess we drop like big girls. Woo! Big hey, Bev is coming out for giving me a hug. Uh, uh, no hugs for me. Yo, yeah, whoa. Who's that little girl? Ah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Gun, 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 gun. Pretty effective. Robots do this shit. Whoa. Ow. Phew. I missed it. Play the thing I've seen. Come on, Jago. Hold this for me, would you? Ninjago! Ooh. Oh, he's got, she's got so much health! Oh, I am F U C K R. Where is it? Ooh, ooh, whoa! Little butt bombs! Oh fuck, they're following me! Uh, leave me alone! Can I shoot them? I can't shoot them! Ah. Leave me alone! I'm a family! Yeah, I don't have them! 
I'm only halfway yet. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Okay, good play, play, move. Oh, that's a lot of damage. I mean, like, at one point, we'll just be using the, the snowboard just to finish him off. I got to the right shotgun. I'm just waiting for it to become second phase. Here comes the, the bombs. The bomber bombs. One group. Oh, oh. God, oh God, oh God. Blah, 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 Jesus Christ on the butter stick. Ugh, come on. Oh, people have to all over the place, fat bitch. Go on. I'm gonna beat this and it's gonna be by skin of my teeth. Oh crap. Die! Please! So look at that little hole in his land. I like me and Tom and Jerry with his music. Ow. Ooh, almost came to the side wedge. Oh, thank God I got some shotgun shells. So we might as well be killing a tank. Feels like I'm killing a tank. Hey, here comes the bomb 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 brains. How do you like that? Ow. Not good, not good. Cool to move. That's pretty dope. Lousy piece of shit! I die! Okay, dad, uh, right into that one. Oh, come on, He's, you're almost dead. That'd be perfect. Yeah, show's oh, over. Not now. Let's just not talk for a while, okay? Fuck your mom. Sergey, did you search Petrov's Thank body, you. my boy? Thank you. Thank did you. Did you find any gold rings on him? No, sir. Petrov didn't have anything on him. Very well. Very well. Again, Report the gold rings. The complex at once. Yes, sir. I'm on my way. Again, just talk about gold rings shit again. Uh, chip on him. Well, that's not Petrov. 
the, again, they're talking about the gold rings. It's gotta be the alpha. Hey, Leonardi says to me, in the grand finale, we're going to put this big old beauty on stage. And what the fuck? It's an old model and it's hard to program. So I'm thinking we should, this is my show, and I'll decide what we should and should not do. You, comrade, are a programmer. So either do your job with a smile on your face or get the hell out of my theater. Comrade Lastuchkin, I completely understand. I was merely offering a suggestion. I don't suppose you'd like something a little heavier? Oh, now you're speaking my language. What have you got for me? Oh, it'll be truly spectacular. You'll love it. I don't think he did love it, because it just revol revolts in a diabetic robot. Oh, at least that's done. That was fun. Oh, waste all my sh ammo. But you know, the game's a game. Eesh. What is your current status, Comrade Major? I'm detecting a loss of focus and an intense surge of emotion. My status? I'm losing my fucking shit. That's my goddamn status. I failed my mission again. Victor's dead, and I've got his head in a damn jar. And Sechenov thinks that's all fine and fucking dandy, get it? No, comrade major. I've done a lot of shit in my day, okay? But I've never lugged a human head around as a trophy. Did you see that gigantic robot in the theater? There was a combat robot in the theater, Charles. But you know what really grinds my gears? No, comrade major. The rings. The motherfucking rings that asshole Petrov gave me. And you know why it grinds my gears? No, comrade major. Me neither. Shit. Whatever. It's okay. It's okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Bro, he's gonna stop him anytime soon. Uh, we're headed to Pavlov. Got any ideas? Pavlov is a secret complex. Located in a remote part of Facility 3826, called Sahalin. It would be quite difficult to get there on foot, given the large number of enemies. I suggest taking a vehicle. And, Comrade Major, this would also be an excellent time to enhance your arsenal as much as possible. Oh, no. Searching for other testing grounds is highly recommended. Seems like it's getting a lot harder than Enough complaining. Let's move. There, there, Major. Whatever you say. <laughs> Aw, thanks, Charles. I feel like my oh, motion is to pull the ammo. <sighs> Christ. You don't know what I'm going to be upgrading here. Crafting. Should be enough. Access granted. Cool. Please select the desired percentage. Access granted. Okay. Um, storage. I need to get some health items soon because I'm all on small ones now. How many problems do I have after finding him? 97. Alright. Let's see. I can get you. Got it. Or oh, this one. Uh, you can use normal capsules with one hand. Or. Oh. Allows you to swap weapons 100% more quickly. This is 67. 87. Alright, I'll go with this one, it's more cheaper. Oh. Oh, that is way quicker. Nice. Sweet. Oh, frame rate just dropped. I wasn't here. Ooh. Oh, satisfying. That was the first time we got a full one. Ooh. Oh, we're back here. 
Oh, I thought it was like some cool secret stuff. Next thing was over there. Oh. Did you enjoy the show? Thank you. Please come again. Come back soon. We're expecting an amazing new batch of robots for your entertainment. The next show will be even more interesting. Please come back here for a sequel. I see you enjoyed the show so much. Please, to purchase a ticket, please go to the ticket booth at the other end of the foyer. Don't forget the snack bar. Please Done. proceed to the bar. Did you leave anything in the coat check room? Please proceed right. into the restroom. What's please happening? Okay, that's weird. That's weird. I'm, I'm, I'm pissing out. Curtain. Major P3, I'm waiting for you in the Pavlov complex. Everything is ready for your arrival. I'll be there as fast as I can. I that's weird. Using a car to move between the research complexes. Gotcha. There was a search of I'll do a GTA on the surface. The place is positively overrun with mutants. <sighs> right. God. Mutants. Got it. Is that all? Just one more question. No. Falatova wasn't there. I understand. You didn't find any gold rings on Petrov's body. Again, did you? this is gold rings. With better one and better two engraved on the inside? No, he didn't have anything on him. P3 out. Again, these, these rings, they gotta be the alphas or the beta Alpha versions. Still in one piece? Hey, Zena! Hey, Zena. Long time no see. I've definitely had better days, but yeah. I guess I'm still in one piece. Did I hear right? You finally got that bastard Petrov. Well, nothing gets by you, huh? Yeah, you got him. Actually, he kind of got himself before I could get him. Don't you worry. If you got his head, that means this will all be over soon. Then you can get some sleep. Now you're speaking my language, Granny Zena. Yeah. Mind if I stop by for a cup of tea? Stop by any time, Sonny. By the way, uh, you didn't have to find any engraved gold rings while you were off chasing after Petrov. No. I didn't, Granny Zena. The trough didn't have anything on him. Oh, that's okay. You just watch yourself, Sonny. Stop by if you need anything. My Granny Zena's the best. At least she cares about me. Why have you deceived everyone, Comrade Major? The trough gave you those rings before he died. Everyone else is deceiving me. Even Dr. Sechenov, and I never saw it coming. On what basis have you drawn this conclusion? I just thought about what Petrov told me. Would you kindly be more specific? Petrov said combat mode was programmed into the bots during construction. He couldn't possibly have reprogrammed them all himself. It's true, goddammit. And why is that? Because Petrov was a pussy. He was a programmer, not a fighter. But these robots know how to fight. He couldn't have programmed them because he doesn't know the first thing about combat. That Natasha was armed with fucking missiles. Where'd it get him, huh? It's a construction robot. Petrov couldn't have armed it. Petrov, that sick shithead, that fucking truth lover. Screw him. So much blood spilt just because he made the sprouts mutate. I highly doubt that Petrov had such a result in mind. He is not a geneticist or a plant breeder and could not have foreseen all the consequences of the malfunction. Then why the hell did he do it? So many people are dead, and the ones with sprouts for heads had to get killed twice. First by the robots, then by me. Morally speaking, Petrov's action cannot be justified. We are in complete agreement in that regard. Fuck Petrov, he's dead. I feel yeah. bad for all those all people. Traffic. I stayed in the service after the war to stop oh, this gosh. kind of thing from happening again. Yeah, I'm clapping out. You have my sincerest condolences Bye. for all that has transpired, Comrade Major. So we do have the rings then. I completely missed that. Charles, why does everyone want those rings so bad? You mean the beta connectors? Because they work, but are also considered not to exist. So nobody can prove they're out there. Not even Collective after the launch. Especially not Collective after the launch. For Collective, anyone connected via the beta connectors will simply not exist. But they'll be able to see Collective. Yes, all of it. A person with a beta connector will not be able to influence Collective from the inside since they won't exist for Collective. But they will know about everything that happens inside it, just like any officially connected human oh. or robot. But can't an officially connected human or robot disconnect from Collective if they want to? Shut they up. can just take their thought device off, right? I believe the fuck so, happened to yes. ask. You believe so? So you're not sure? Or is there something you're not telling me? I have no data, Comrade Major. But no one can stop a person from removing his or her thought device. It's worn on the head, 
not implanted in the skull. That's good, I guess. So damn, these things Charles, are really no effective. Charles, force somebody into collective, right? Petrov the... was wrong about that. Not entirely. What do you it's mean, not entirely? The betas. I'm not a member of collective. How can collective Rush. find out about me? It's quite simple. Let's say you walk past a robot. The robot identifies you as out. a human, but you are not wearing a thought device. The robot fails to receive mental commands from you in response to its queries. So it realizes I'm not in collective and tells the others about it. Then what? They all start giving me shit about it? Essentially, yes. But I can just put my thought on, walk past the bot and do everything I'm supposed to do, then take the thought off, right? Essentially, yes. Then why is everyone so hot and bothered about the rings? I can't say for sure. Perhaps it's an issue of convenience. Thought devices need to be reconfigured every time they are put on. A ring can be taken off and put back on without inconvenience. There's got to be more to it than that. Maybe. The very damn the US is constantly introducing sanctions against our civilian robots. Why do they do that? Do they suspect something? The U.S. government clearly has certain suspicions, or at least concerns. Yeah, it's their job to be concerned about their Medical country's Chekhov. security. But they don't have oh. any hard evidence. That means they don't really have a leg to stand on, right? Look, we're having a fight. That is precisely why Petrov caused the malfunction. Okay, let's yeah. take some tests. We wanted to show the world that our city bots have a combat mode. Fine. But the Americans don't know that. So what are the sanctions for? The American government is using the sanctions to find a middle ground between the needs of the capitalists and the growing discontent of the working class. You mean American working stiffs want to get our bots banned because they're taking their factory jobs? And the capitalists want to get more free robots so they can get rid of all the workers once and for all? Quite right. The American government is feeling pressure from both sides. So the sanctions are oh, on without banning robots entirely. They merely set focus on importing them. So why does the Soviet Union get off, give get a off. Shit? Who cares if the Americans sanction us? They're the ones stopping themselves from getting rid of the working class. Or good. They're all about the workers. The more restrictions they place on the I'm import of the robots, the fewer of our robots will be located in key parts of the American government that collect and launches. So the Soviet government wants there to be as many of our civilian robots in the U.S. as possible when they activate combat mode. That'll make it that much easier to take over the country. I gotta admit, it makes sense. Okay, let's just chill here. Or it is in a sack. Number one? We don't have to read them all. Yeah. All right. Um, Pavada, my treasure. I understand, but more than more, the patients are coming from Polaf every day. There are so many of them, and I'm just one man. My team of buffoons don't count. They're worthless as doctors. Let's do this. Let's do this. I'll take the more in interesting cases, and hopefully, Collective 2.0 can treat the rest of them. I doubt that. Saharov didn't die, comrade. Saharov lives. What? Who are you? What are you talking about? I am an assistant professor from AOC. It matters not. Saharov lives. The ho oh timer. Um. Zaharov? He is Doctor Sechenov's closest supporter. Ooh. The man genius may surpass Sechenov himself. It was believed Zaharov perished a few years ago in an unfortunate accident. But he did not. I studied the documents, and all of the most revolutionary papers show signs of his involvement. His personal touch, if you like. I worked with him personally and knew his attitude well. Caustic comments, radical methods, unmitigated interruptions. He is most definitely alive. But one question remains. If he is alive and still working, why would somebody hide it? Yeah, sounds like a conspiracy theory to me. Right now, it's hard to tell who's alive and who isn't. Yeah, what's this one say? Um, a card has been issued by V. Valviv. We couldn't get we couldn't get rid of him, so we put him in the free room. Management says he's he can see a Volveva 
without a ha hazmat suit if he really wants to. He's been brought to his wife at the Polar under the ground a couple of times. His condition is under transit observation. Security hasn't been notified since there's no way he will ever leave the Polar. All right. Is that it? I don't know what happens, I don't know what happens to that sploosh, but I'm just taking the, the W here. Let's read this. Let's watch this, this first one. Everything's fine. Take it easy now. Boss is no one to do. Stephen, I haven't even been here a week yet, and I've already seen enough corpses for a lifetime. I thought this place was going to be a regular clinic. I had no idea it was like this. <laughs> Didn't the fact that this place is a secret complex tip you off? You're a little green to be a guard, especially at a hospital. Listen, we're not butchers like those scientists. We're not here to kill. We just make sure no one runs off. Fine, freely. Ooh, okay. Oh, no that body. Autolysis starts approximately seven to ten minutes after death, followed by defecation in three to five minutes. Rigor mortis sets in five to six hours. Then let me see. Complete decomposition in about five years. Yeah, nasty. Ugh, nasty. What? Why? Naked facts, pure numbers. What is nasty about science? What are you talking about? I am a scientist. I must spend every moment examining and cataloging nature's phenomena. Comrade, do you know many people capable of documenting the decomposition of their own body? I don't really want to, but I'm kind of intrigued. I understand the grave importance of your mission. Don't let me distract you. Oh, Kapoffel Kopf! You made me lose my concentration. Let's start again. I'm good. Kapoffel Kopf. Oh, Kapoffel Kopf. Kapoffel Kopf. Kapoffel Kopf. What does this say? Comrade Hewis, a patient here came from the pool at the, 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 the Verlov today. The guys and I are be betting on whatever or not the diagnostics folks would pick her up. All information about her is top secret. You're gonna love it. A Novala 24 nervous system extensively afflicted by unnatural toxins progress um, de 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 degeneration of t muscle tissues, difficulty breathing, coma. Hmm. Sign stuff. Oh, we're in the morgue. Um, I've got bad news for men. The pool of just a message saying that you have a small dick. It also says a pool of needs cases to be moved to the underground labs. The poor guy that is their problem now. It's a pay it's it's an important and unique case, and they say we aren't up for the task. Make note. Slowed speech and mild deterioration observed. Nothing found in the blood so far. I won't let these fuckers take my patience, but how about a little breaking and entering, Fermin? You you with me? Breaking to a morgue? How scandal. Who? Do you guys? I'm going home. It's a douche. Back to the Vav like back to the pool off complex. Charles, what is this place? I mean, what is this complex even for? The Pavlov complex is the origin of all the facilities for the or came here. biological innovations. Unique experiments are conducted here, involving everything from breeding new species of farm animals to developing new space exploration technology. Outer space? You mean they make moon rovers here, not Chalamet? Space exploration is about more than just vehicles. A spaceship and rovers will of course be required, but what then? What about after humans reach the Red Planet? You mean they breed animals from Mars here? Among other things, yes. In addition to breeding new species of animals suitable for Martian conditions, Soviet science is looking for ways to bolster man's ability to exist on Mars. So what, they're gonna give us gills so we can swim gas oceans? Gas oceans are on Jupiter. Mars features low temperatures and lethal hurricanes. Ooh. But you're basically correct. The capabilities of your species have yet to be fully studied. So the latest medical breakthroughs, new life support systems, from here. Indeed, Comrade Major. So many geniuses worked here for the good of all mankind. And now 
they're gone. Yo, this moves are fucking clapped. Oh, I got you. There you guys, boo boo! Let's we'll turn up. Me, Mark. Yeah, that blue thing's health bar is still there. Oh, for love of shit. Well, let's see you later. Oh, I'm gonna do ACDC. Metallica? Whoa! Let me do. Make this, I am ghost. Will I do it? Yep. 
think I did. That Pugash bar sold there. So this is pizza. This goes hard on these doors. I didn't check all the way upstairs. Stuff I desperately need. Right. This. Oh, they deleted. Play music again. Oh, 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 chest. Oh, aha. Gotcha. Oh, that was intense. Downstairs. Yeah, well, I'm just exploring. Oh god, it's all them over there. Oh, time to do the most doom thing ever. Never mind. It's even over there. A bunch of enemies. Oh, 
go one handed reload. That's cool. Do not die. I guess that was worth coming down for then. Oh, okay. Ooh, they give me a lot of ammo. That they give me a ton of ammo. Alright, time to read these. That's offline. Deleted data. Just looking at a wall. I don't know what to cover for this is though. Eh. I'll survive. Okay. Boop. There we go. Let's, let's listen to this now. Defo dead. Let's ignore him and open this up. Oh, you see me? Too bad. You're about to die. Oh, you did a shock of that. God. Well, I think that's a good stop point to start the episode. No, quite a bit so far. Please select the desired Let's see. Um, before we end the episode, I want to see what we can put in and put out of storage. I could get rid of you, but I'll keep you. Get a lot of parts for it, though. I mean, I'm not really gonna use this, though, am I? Though, if, if there's a new game plus and I could craft all this again, it would be nice. But then there's a the fact of the whole. Mm, I'll keep on to it. Upgrade again, but eh, uh, no. Then just recoil. Rare fire. Mm. I want to see what type of good upgrades I can get. I'll just increase the 
something. Decrease, decrease spread. Let's just no. Hey, we're the mag. I got none of the other stuff left now. Nice. So, what are these? 119 and increase maximum health. This one's next. What's this one? Your excellent marksmanship skills increase accuracy with your unarmed shooting. Good. Definitely get this one next episode. 165 Palmer. The so next episode, we have all this done. And after that, we can probably do Shock. That's that. That one's almost done. 35, 87, 55, 95. Or Frostbite. Maybe then after that, do the Palmer Shield. Yeah. A plush thing sparse over here. Right. Oh, I can get rid of you. Move you to Nora. Waters. Yep. And okay. Say one more time. Saving data. Data. Very good stop spot space. We did quite a lot in this episode. We've did the whole rest of um we did the whole theater area basically that Petrov's dead now so things are going to get things have got a lot more complicated so now we're going to turn his head to somewhere in the Pulav the, the Pavlov and see what we can do with that I'm guessing use his like regnal scanner to do something with his head I don't know we still got like see what happens we still don't know what happened in the big sky city. I'm hoping that crashes down. That'd be so cool. Plus, we still got that mysterious woman. Saying, keep saying, Remember, you left the stove on. And all that stuff. So, still a lot of answer needs to be filled. And for the way it's looking, I might be right about the whole fact that... Um, our father figure... I keep forgetting his name. Is going to like using us or betray us in, in the in the end. And we've got the rings, which I don't remember getting. I thought I, I thought we were looking for them. I do not remember getting them at all. Oh God, it must have been uh, like earlier in the game. I just forgot. But it doesn't matter. We still got like a decent chunk of the game left. I think. Who knows? Maybe I don't know. I don't know how long this game is going to be. I'm gonna leave you here. Great stuff, progress. Very interesting. Super fun. Boss fights are really fun. Boss fights are probably my favorite part so far. Cause it's just so like fun. And I'm like in the zone all the time. It's like cool, cool. Dodge, dodge, dodge. Get some shots in. Boom, boom, boom. Very like, very doom-like. Love that. But again, I'm gonna leave you here. So thanks for watching, everybody. And if you did, make sure you check out my other stuff on the channel. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Very helpful. And if you have any games you want me to try out on the channel, come down, come in and put them down in the comments. And I'll check them out. Until then, yeah. See you around on the next episode or stream. Have a good day. Enjoy your life. Be chill. Don't cause a robot apocalypse. I'll see you around, everyone. Till then, your boys gonna be banging some robo chicks. See ya. Bye. Bye, Zs. <laughs>